DayMap 8 is the 2015 mid-year release of the DayMap Learning Management System. This is a stability release mainly consisting of bug fixes and improvements to our latest major version, DayMap 8. However, it does contain some new features that are detailed in this short video. The full release notes for DayMap 8.1 have been distributed to the DayMap coordinators in your school. Our useful alerts can still be viewed on the day plan, but we have now added an alert center that allows you to view and manage your alerts in full screen mode. Tick the box to dismiss an alert. Click view all alerts to see your full set of alerts, including dismissed alerts. We've added two attendance features to the DayMap 8 class page based on user feedback. The role marking tab on the class page now has an option to display all classes for the week. This can be achieved by checking the Map All Classes button. A link to the class summary from the class page has been created. The link is now displayed on the right hand side of the Reports Attendance Map tab. In the DayMap Student Summary, we've added two features to enhance experience and make student profiles easier to manage. When sending a student note as a DayMap message, you can now add recipients to the message beyond the student's timetable, teachers, and contacts. In the Attachments tab of the Student Summary, a Sort By drop-down list has been added with options of Newest First, oldest first, and name, to make it easy to manage student attachments as they accumulate over time. Silverlight has now been removed from the DayMap assessment marking process. The All Results tab will now automatically calculate the grade when a mark is entered on the new assessment marking grid. We've also added a reminder about ticking the Work Receive button when marking assessments. This button is automatically ticked when students submit work via DayMap, but needs to be ticked by you if work is submitted by hand. As a tip, if you're not collecting student work for a task, you can switch off notifications about overdue or unsubmitted work to students and parents by removing the tick from Track Students Submitting Work in the Assessment Task Details. We've added two new tabs to the Parent Portal Settings page for DayMap administrators. The Parent Permissions tab displays the student note categories and student records or forms that parents have permissions to view. This gives schools the ability to make specific student information more visible to parents and more control over which student information is shared with parents. The Problematic Accounts tab lists students with no parent contact as well as parents with invalid email addresses. Users are now directed to a new, more pleasant looking error page which also logs the error into the database so that the support team can retrieve its details. If you do reach the error page, you can copy the error message to send to your DayMap coordinator, who can send it to DayMap support if required. We're looking forward to your feedback on these new features, and always welcome feature requests, which you can submit by emailing support at daymap.net. DayMap, connecting the school community.